Greetings and salutations, we're back, good old Hellas, and uh, we will advance the storyline in this fine day. I have, as you might see, I've done some side quests, but uh, I haven't advanced the main storyline particularly, so we're gonna do that now. Hello lads, fucking juicy. isn't this remarkable? We're so close to the gods, I can feel Apollo all around me. How did it go with Elpino? We can talk later in private. Who's this? Just a simple pilgrim. He just saw the oracle. I couldn't help but ask if she's as glorious as they say. Well, is she? She left me with more questions than answers. That's the oracle for you. Uh, I may have mentioned you. That's, um, that's fine, bro. But, uh, for the next time, we should be more secretive. I would appreciate you showing a bit more secrecy. Well, it's just he seemed interested in legends. Like you. I, I thought you might get along. How did... Aha, that's actually Herodotus, the, um... History, bro. Who art thou really? You know my spear just by looking at it? You're more than some simple pilgrim. All things in Delphi are more than they appear. Even I. My name is Herodotus. I'm a storyteller. Fwah, Mirin. This war is forcing us all to new extremes. <laughs> that much is true. Why are you hiding your identity? I'm here on behalf of a man in Athens. A very powerful man. We intend to finally end this war. You told me you came to ask the Oracle a personal question. War is personal, Barnabas. So, you came to seek the Pythia's guidance on how to end the war? I did. Though something is wrong in Delphi. Guards at every turn people being turned away. What did the oracle tell you, mate? You don't seem convinced the Pythia can be believed. What did she tell you? I asked her to show the path to the war's end. She said, spring should not wish for winter, as it brings death with it. Such wisdom! I don't understand a word of it, but that's why she's in there, and we're out here. I know a threat when I hear one. <laughs> you were on Kefalonia for too long. I have questions for the Oracle. I have my own questions for the Pythia, but this line... I'll be an old man by the time I see her. <laughs> You're joking! You carry more blades than a field of grass! I didn't come here to start trouble. Trouble? Just walk in! Who's going to stop you? The priest? <laughs> That's true. He uh, is a man of wisdom. All right. But if things get out of hand, I'm blaming you, Varnavas. Is he not every bit as great as I said? That's the kind of friends you, um, you must have. Uh, so yes, I actually did a uh, one of the main quests that was the killer guy but i thought it was a side quest that's why i did it but anyway uh, it was so long since i was here so we might as well just uh, talk to this guy fucking juicy bro i'm here to see the pythia only those chosen by the light of apollo may enter how does one get chosen one goes to the back of the line do i look like someone who waits in line Far too uh, important and glorious to wait in a line. Enter into the light of Apollo. There is one aesthetic statue. That illuminates shadow. Choose your question wisely, mortal. 
for you have but one. Speak, truth seeker. Ha! This is... Uh... Now we have to choose, actually. I think if we find the mother, we might be able to ask where the father is. So, where is my mother? Tell me. I lost my mother when I was young. I have to find her. Where is she? It's you! From the visions! The child on the mountain! How could you know that? You need to leave. Now. Leave? Do you have any idea what I've been through to get here? Oh, but I do. While in Kausos, you didn't cower in the face of the priest. A child and her family still live thanks to you. But how? No one can hide from the light. Please. I've come this far. You must have the answers I seek. Child of the mountain. The cult of Cosmos have eyes everywhere. They will kill you. Cult of Cosmos? The Oracle has spoken! The prophecy is yours! You never answered my question! The Bithia is done for the day. I'm not leaving until I get answers! Rotatos, you're still here. Where's Varnavas? He's gone back to your ship. You don't look happy with your prophecy. She... knew who I was. <laughs> She's the Pythia. It's her business to act like she knows you. That was no act. She said she had visions of me as a child on a mountain. What child hasn't stood on a mountain? I was thrown from that mountain. My life started and ended on that mountain. I'm telling you, she knew who I was, what I'd done. Tried to warn me. Warn you? About what? I trust this uh, guy, so I will tell him. The Cult of Cosmos. She mentioned the Cult of Cosmos. Does this mean anything to you? I'd heard whispers. A cult unlike any other coming to Delphi. But I paid them no mind. The Pythia seemed afraid of them. Guards took her away. Took her away? Then the whispers were true. If this cult has corrupted the Pythia... This is devastating news. Do you understand what this means? Through her, the cult controls the world. I need to speak with her, when she's not so well protected. That would require a miracle from the gods. She is always protected. Where can I find the Pythia? You know more about the Pythia than I do. Where would she be? When she's not in the temple of Apollo, she's at her home in the Hora of Delphi. All right, mate. I'll find where the Pythia lives. And I will get answers. Alexios, don't forget. Brute force is useless when finesse is required. That's true. Although there is a um, there is a Swedish saying that goes something like this: If uh, you can't do it with violence, try more violence. Obviously, a um, saying that perhaps isn't as uh, well used today in uh, today's Sweden. But uh, remember that Sweden wasn't always. Um, as perhaps cucked as it is today, we have a long history of being mad cunts. So obviously, it's part of my holy work to try to revive uh, that. Oh, there you are. Hello, horsey. Phobos. A loyal and good steed, if there ever was one. So anyway, talking about... Apollo and Dionysus. I had an interesting conversation when I was in good old America last uh, year with a um, enlightened and aesthetic and jacked guy who said that he, and I will not mention his name because I don't want to dox anyone, but he mentioned uh, that he is uh, Apollo every day of the month 
except for the last month, or at least one day a month where he is Dionysus. And he said that, uh, because we were talking about intoxication and alcohol, etc. And he said that it is necessary to sometimes vent the Dionysian spirit within yourself to be able to maintain the Apollones of uh, the, the rest of the time. And uh, I thought it was quite a good argument, actually, to... Um, the Oracle is hiding inside. I'll when we're talking about the various festivities, etc. Now we see, I have um, I have made a video on it, but I've removed it because it wasn't good enough. I will remake the video on alcohol, but uh, what I can say now is that do not get drunk in public. If you're gonna get drunk, you have to do it with um, a lot of protection for the Pythia. in a secluded environment. And uh, make sure you don't do anything stupid, but uh, that will have to be for a separate video. Now, we have to... Aha! We have a mercenary there that we need to illuminate. Perhaps I can kill him. You're but a dog! Aha! He recognized me. Alright, come at me, brah. Fucking sick physique. It was uh, a while since I played, so if I'm a bit noobish, you know why. I'm gonna try to destroy this bastard at least. Perhaps this guy has blasphemed against Apollo. Die, unbeliever. Right, die then. On another note, if you haven't already seen my post here on YouTube, and also of course post on uh, Instagram, I have uh, restocked all of the hoodies at Lego Gloria, in addition to uh, the re-release of a uh, classic, the Celtic Cross, uh, what? The Celtic Cross headscarf. Um, or neck warmer, rather. It's a bit of an updated, it's more of a garment than the last one. Hmm, but now we need to concentrate so I can uh, illuminate this bastard. Go on then. Die. These uh, guys, they've been shaving with Gillette razors, I think. That's why I need to uh, destroy them. There we are. Cultist God. Kind of a cool thing though, having a cultist God. At least they're not the cult of Slanesh. Boom. Interact. No! Guards! I'm not here to hurt you. I just want answers. The Pythia is a sacred vessel of the gods. People travel the world for my answers. But none of them would dare break into my home. Apollo's wrath will be cruel and swift. Apollo God! favors me. I, um, I think it goes against my code of honor to threaten women, even in uh, games, so I'll go with... Please, fair maiden, I need to know. I'm looking for my family. And everywhere I go... People are either lying or trying to kill me. You're the first person who might have some answers. But they'll kill me if I tell you. Not if I get to them first. Help me, and no harm will come to you. I promise. All right. But ask your questions quickly. The longer you're here, the more at risk we both are. Now, the first question, obviously, is if she um, is Mirin Gaines. But uh, that's not an option here, for some reason. What is the cult of Cosmos? What is this cult of Cosmos? They are the eyes that see, but go unseen. Enough with the riddles. I want names. I don't know. I swear. They hide behind masks and shrouds. All right, mate. Why dost thou work Why for them? Why would you work for the cult? I have no choice. So... 
All those prophets you always have a choice. Gods. All those people? You're paid to deceive them all? Most want to know about love or death. I tell them what they want to hear. But when people want to know about war or politics, I'm paid very well to tell them what the cult wants them to hear. Where did the visions come from? You said you saw me in your visions. What did you see? There is an artifact under the temple of Apollo. It reveals what only the gods should know. You called me the child on the mountain. The cult hunts a Spartan child who survived the terrible fall from Mount Taietos. The artifact revealed that child to be you. Only one thing left. I'm going to find the cult. You have an opportunity to do the right thing. Tell me where to find the cult. Tell me where they are, or we'll go find them together. Beneath the Temple of Apollo, there is an ancient chamber. I think they meet there. But without one of their cloaks and masks, you won't make it more than two steps inside. Where can I find one of these cloaks and masks? There is a man. He visits me from time to time, makes sure I'm well taken care of. I have the biggest house in the Hora of Delphi, yet he still offers Drachmi for my troubles. <sighs> Gives me the creeps. What's his name? Elpinor. Elpinor? He's with the cult? I can't be sure, but if he is, he would definitely have what you require. I sent Elpinor to the underworld. I knew the mask I stripped from his corpse would come in handy. May Apollo protect you. Milady. Tips Picklehaube. I should tell Irodotos what the Pythia told me about the cult. Maybe he'll have some insight. Hmm, who's this guy now? I had... I had to do it to him. It was the only reasonable course of action. I'm actually gonna illuminate this bastard too. Ah, we actually have treasure here. But uh, I will rediscover or go back to this place later off off camera so to speak because now we have to damn admire this statue imagine in uh, if we win the culture war and manage to restore europe to its rightful owners that is us the native europeans imagine and we can build statues like this all over europe and america of course and australia whenever i say europe i always include the colonists as well. Hello, bro. What's up? Well, what did the Pythia tell you? The cult of Cosmos is hunting me, but I'm going to hunt them first. She told me they meet in a secret chamber under the Temple of Apollo. So it's all true. If the cult has done anything, it's fooled this old man. I've killed the first cultist, Helpinor. A snake I met in Cephalonia. His mask and cloak will get me inside the chamber. So they're underneath the Temple of Apollo? Yes, by the Cave of Yea. I think I know the place. Find it, and I'll meet you there. The truth will out. That reminds me of a certain documentary, which I uh, have promoted quite heavily. Last time, a few days ago, on my Instagram, posted it in a story. And I'm, of course, talking about the greatest story never told. So, truth will out. A good, um, a good saying. Wouldn't you agree, Phobos? The horse agrees. That's uh, what he said there. So, anyway, in regards to... Uh, Ah, that was a... A mercenary, he didn't see us. In regards to Apollo and Dionysus, 
I think it is, or I know it is, important to um, reignite these types of uh, archetypes and uh, myths in order to reawaken the European spirit. Um, and I can base that upon the simple fact that the great enemy, uh, the liberal leftist establishment, they are doing everything in their power to ridicule and uh, distort our uh, myths and our history. So keep that in mind. Obviously, until we have uh, the possibility to build statues such as this, we will simply have to create artwork here in the Immaterium. So if you make, if you are good with uh, Photoshop or something like that, if you are somewhat of an artist, make sure to uh, do a lot of um, things that um, promote the sort of aesthetics. Same thing goes for uh, music. Shout out as always to my man Elessar. Music is a great way to uh, promote identity. That being said, we're gonna talk to our historian bra. Greetings. So, this is it. Hidden chamber of the cultists. Here, all along. I'm going inside. Keep my clothes for me. Best not to go in with your weapons, either. I don't think they'll look too kindly on that. How do I look? Dashing, if anything. Terrifying. Good. Find me once you've found out the truth in there. Terrifying might Keep be a more appropriate Try not description, to actually, can you think of it? Me? Rash? Right, let's do this, lads. Let's do this, Laddington. These ridiculous costumes were a good idea. Well, they're quite um, quite cool, though. If I may be so bold as to state that. Hello, lads. The Corinthian helmets on display, absolutely aesthetic. It's a good thing Vimos hasn't arrived yet. Sorry, it's my uh, first time. A new recruit? <gasps> welcome, welcome. I don't really want to ask this because that might. I'll go talk to the others. That might uh, yes, reveal yes, our nature as an uh, imposter. Who knows if you'll get a word in after that? Quite epic snake there from the ceiling. It's only blood right now, but who knows? Remus may ask for our hands next. Go on, go on. Make your offering. I will make the offering. We just have to keep our sights on what the bloodline will do for us. The bloodline? The mother, the father, the brother. You know, her kin. We need them. All of them. To use them? That information is not for Demos, of course. You know how volatile she is. She could rip through us easily. I'll be sure to keep it to myself. As you should. Nor can she know we're about to capture her mother. <laughs> what would we do with the mother? And do what with her? I would lower my voice if I were you. Just know she will be put to good use. 
Unless she's uncontrollable. This, um, are a bunch of degenerates, I'm afraid. Where is the mother? Where she is? No, but it won't be long until we do, I assure you. She's the cult's next target. And who might Deimos be? Tell me about Deimos. She's shown us what we need to know. She's a machine, a weapon for the cult. Someone that unstable can't be trusted with such personal information. We're done here, mate. I have to go. To our great ambition. To ambition. I'll need much more information to identify who these cultists are. I'm gonna talk to this mad cunt. I'm Critics. still not convinced. You. We need another opinion on this. Why split the resources searching for a woman we can't find? If we narrow our focus, Athens will be ours. Immediate threats have to be destroyed. Pericles has to be destroyed. Not without the mother. We aren't strong enough without the mother. Don't let Demos hear that. If anything, we should be hunting the father. <sighs> we know who the mother is. Looking for the father would be a waste of resources. What do you think? Hunt the champion's mother or her father? The mother. The mother. He's right. Get your priorities straight. Before you know it, Pericles will shore up his defenses and we will have lost our chance. Now, if you'll excuse me. I hear perfectly well. You're just wrong. We need to look for the father now. All right, we need to uh, talk with some other people. But uh, whom might we talk to? Maybe you. No, you don't want to talk to me. Ah, I have found another clue. Letters to and from the court. Gods. They have a foothold in every part of the Greek world. We're in more danger than I thought. All of the Greek world, including Sicily, Syracuse, and uh, southern Italy. Okay, so we have some thing more to uh, investigate here. I suppose it might be in this uh, cave over here. Hello, lads. What are you? What are you doing here? Pull yourselves together, Malaka. You're a fucking pig before slaughter. I'll do it, I swear. I'll kill him. Let me go. You like to watch, you sick fuck. You're not just going to watch. You're going to teach this little insolent shit a lesson. But what did he do? Does he deserve it? Does it fucking matter, does it? What I say goes. No questions asked. I... I couldn't do it. But I'm not scared. Not anymore. If you can't kill a fucking Archon, what are you gonna do when I tell you to kill a fucking Archon? I will. I will. I'll kill Phidias. I don't know, bro. I... Show him what happens to cowards. They get fucking burned. You do it, mate. No. He's yours. <laughs> you don't know what the fuck fun is. <laughs> More for me. <laughs> <laughs> fuck with me and there's plenty more where that came from. All right. Strange. I feel something now get towards the, the pyramid. Of here it's covered in shards, like Alpinors. Yeah, he, uh, he deserved it. 
uh, for trying to, well, for uh, for being a bad person, I suppose. All right, let's uh, do this. Let's place the fragments and see what uh, what might happen. Go on, mate. Do it. Ah, you had the last piece. Now it is ready. Every time I see it, it calls to me and sings of power. Does it call to you like it calls to me? I want to touch it. It does. What are you doing? Have you lost your mind? Uh, no. She hasn't even arrived yet. Gather yourself and hold your tongue, fool. Show respect for the bloodline. Hi, isn't that actually... Our sister, or something. El Pinor is dead. One of you is a traitor. The artifact will expose them. You! Everyone will be tested. You first. Go. All right, sister, go on. Pick me. I will show you, you the true nature of what we've done to Elpinor. Quite uh, aesthetic armor she has. If we will uh, give her some credit. Nice jawline as well there. Yes, I supposed correctly. It is indeed our uh, our baby sister. That's how it goes. The traitor is dead. She had uh, to do it. There was no other choice. Oh, 
You're alive. The cult is after my mother. My family. They want my mother dead. I see. It's worse than I thought. There's more. They have a weapon. What kind? A soldier. Stronger and more ferocious than any I've ever seen. Herodotus. It's my sister. We need to get to Athens. Athens? We need to find my mother. My clothes. Spear. Uh, uh, of course. My spear. The cult of Cosmos called my sister. Demos. She used an artifact to see my memories. Alexios, the man I serve, we must tell him what's happened before it's too late. You've heard the name Pericles before. Aha, uh -huh. what to choose here? And I had actually thought to make a video on democracy later today. Anyway, Pericles is a great general. Pericles is the great general leading the Thelian League against the Spartans. They say he's ruthless. We aren't leading the League against anyone. Pericles is a man of peace. This war was thrust upon him. A man of peace and prosperity. Upon us all. A general who doesn't want war. Not likely. Save your doubts. He is working to end this war. We all are. If there are forces colluding against him, he must be warned. We have to go. I'm only worried about my mother. To Athens? They're hunting my family. My mother. I have to find her. You carry the blade of Leonidas. Act like it. If Pericles doesn't put an end to this war, we're all as good as dead. Including your mother. Fuck your war! The cultists are exterminating my family! You have a duty to the Greek world. We both do. Pericles must be warned. She is my mother. What would you have me do? If there is one place where we can find information about your mother, it is in Athens. How? Pericles surrounds himself with the brightest minds in Athens, which is to say anywhere. In Athens, you can fulfill your duty to your family. But before we can go, I need you to meet me at the Lion of Leonidas, at Thermobile. Leonidas? Why? There's something I need to know. Something that may help us take down this cult and save your mother. You've proven I can trust you. But let's make it quick, Herodotus. First to Romopoli, then we go to Athens. Sounds like a great plan. And Make sure every single one of these cultists dies by my hands. With uh, that said, I will uh, actually take my leave. And I hope you have a prosperous day ahead. Thank you for watching. XXO. Boo.